Hey guys, Matt, Iron Trap Garage, and today we're going to be working on the 39 Ford Forgotten Hot Rod again. Now, we have the frame all painted, everything clean and ready to go in the last episode. We're now ready to finally paint all the suspension parts and put everything together. So we're going to show you the process, and hopefully by the end of this video, I have a rolling frame, which will be really awesome.
so to make sure I don't trip over anything. Yeah, why don't you like Spencer grab one hand? All right, so we're right here. Let's get this. If you want to stand that up, I'll uh, guide it down. Okay. That's Come good. back a little more. Whip will up if you can, actually. That's all I got. Okay. That's all right for now. Okay, because it'll, yeah. I mean, it's there, so. You got the frame? My way, just yeah, here, Matt. I can see the nut on the bottom. To the to this way? My way, yeah. There, there, there you go. go. Yeah, of course. Okay. Alright. Yeah. That's pretty that's the gist of it from there you can disconnect everything. Yeah. You have that. I have the bracket right gotta, here. I gotta find the bolts. Okay. I thought they had left to do. All right, so got the frame all set down on the suspension with the help from some friends, and uh, we got this thing rolling again. Really darn exciting. It seems like just yesterday we were dragging it out of the uh, out of the junkyard, and now we have a frame and suspension. It's all painted together, and uh, sort of looks like something. So we skipped over a couple of things that I did throughout throughout the way, just to kind of uh, keep the video from being really long and drawn out. Uh, I went through and cleaned and painted the tie rods, I put new tie rod ends in, a bunch of that different stuff, the clamps for the springs, all that stuff, but basically the gist of it is everything was clean, painted with rust encapsulator plus, and then uh, ceramic chassis black to make everything sealed up and tough and it'll last, uh, it'll outlast me really. So now that we've got all this together, we're going to start bar bolting all the parts on that we, wanna ha we don't want to have to mess with when the body's on, so we're going to bolt on the, uh, the the Yankee Speed, old Yankee Speed Co. Uh, brake adapter, put one of those dual circuit master cylinders on there, run the brake lines. I actually just scored the, this past week as we were filming this video, a, uh, a brand new unused Bob Drake gas tank for one of these in the box that was at an estate that I was buying at. And uh, so that's great so we can get the gas tank bolted in, get all this brake lines run, and then we can drop the engine and trans in really, really soon, which is really exciting. So. That's kind of the next couple of videos. We'll just be assembling all the different stuff for the brakes and suspension, getting the engine and trans in, and dolling any of that stuff up that we want to doll up. And then uh, basically it's just maybe try and make the engine run, depending on timing, cut out the old four, drop it on, bing, bang, boom. We're driving down the road doing burnouts. Everything's awesome. So we'll see. But that's all I have for this one. Appreciate you guys following along as always. We do videos on Tuesdays, Fridays, and Sundays. If you haven't, Subscribe, tell a friend, spread the word. We appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm.